Hi folks, it's me, Chad, again, CAC Home Auto Projects. Um, like I said yesterday, we're getting some rain. No field fires, but guess what? Small garage fire. Had to go to the next town south, help them out a little bit of mutual aid. It's all good, because I know when we call them, they're right there. So, um, But I don't have a whole lot of time today, because i got to go to work just a little bit early. I just wanted to show you something I found out I've got a tenant in the garage okay yesterday in my video guys I had a window on the trunk lid guess what I came in last night to grab some tools because my uh, furnace in the garage or in the garage I'm sorry in the house decided to quit working well when I came in there was a uh, Big old fat raccoon sitting on top of my car. If you remember right, I had that window that Tana and I painted flames on sitting on the trunk lid. Well, what you're looking at right here is that window shattered. Because when I turned the light on, that raccoon scrambled and he knocked that window on the floor. Well, I had to tell Tana about it. He knocked, knocked everything off the trunk lid onto the floor. I had to tell Tana about it. Boy, she cried. And there's not a whole lot gets to me, folks, but when my little girl's upset, I get upset too. To be honest with you, I, I tell you what, seeing her cry <laughs> just about makes me want to cry. So let me tell you what we're going to do. She's uh, She's got a spot right up here on the wall. Okay, I'm going to move the... The vent pipes and all that good stuff out of the way. I wonder why my door's left open. I don't like doors being left open and I don't like drawers being left open. It invites injury. Um, this area right here, I'm going to move the metal, the sheet metal, and I'm going to move the pipes, the stove, old stove pipes from the wood burner, put the rakes back where they belong, and right in here, I'm going to get a piece of sheet metal. We're going to paint it black, and we're going to go ahead and do some flames on it, and we're going to hang it up right here. That way, if it gets knocked over again, it won't hurt anything. Because that kind of stuff right down there, guys, she's so excited about doing things out here. Um, especially when, once she did the flames, man. She just wanted to paint flames all the time. And uh, she just really... I know I shouldn't be walking on it, but I want to grab a piece. Oh, this is the, this is the one that I I did with the orange. But uh, she's so excited. Oh, hey, that's... You actually can't feel that it's broken from the outside edge. I'm running my hand over it, and it's just as smooth as it was before. A couple little, little spots, but... Uh, I'm not going to let her play out here or be out here until I get it all cleaned up. Um, like I was saying, after she painted flames, she was all excited about painting. And I got to I gotta do something because this just crushed her. And you can see I got pieces of glass clear up in my hood scoop and everything. And uh, so we're going to do this other one because I don't want any ambition to be ruined by a big fat raccoon that's decided to take up residency on the other side of my cardboard over there. Things over there, the reason that cardboard's up there, it cuts my garage just about in half. Um, Cause honestly, I'm gonna I'm be honest with you, we're storing stuff over there, doesn't belong to us. There was a death in the family about seven years ago. And we said we'd store stuff for a short time. Well, we're still stuck with it, but guess what? We got critters living in there now. What they did, as they came in up there, right up in here, on the other side, they ripped the fascia boards loose outside and came in. Oh, well, they got a nest back here. Raccoons carry disease. Can't have that. Can't have that at all. So the next decent day we get, we're going to rip that down out there. We're going to rip that down, yeah. We're going to pull the stuff out, go through it. Whatever he's been into is gone. I hate to hate to get any hard feelings or anything, but 
You know what? I, it's, I can't have it. Bad deal. So, all right. Well, I'm gonna wrap that up because, like I said, I gotta go in early, and I'll get back with you tomorrow. Thanks, guys. We'll talk to you later. Everybody, keep up the good work. Indiana? Spoken like a true loser.